A new CBS News New York Times poll finds Barack Obama with a 16-point lead. You know what that means. Time for Hillary to start whipping up the fake tears. The New York Times is reporting that John McCain carried on an inappropriate relationship with a much younger lobbyist. The good news? No sex tape. Christian conservative candidate Mike Huckabee announced his plan to wipe out the trillion dollar deficit. He's going to pass the collection plate from the West Coast and back. Reporters suspect that John Edwards is leaning towards supporting Barack Obama. He was interviewed at a salon getting cornrows. Aides for Mitt Romney say he may re-enter the race for president. Or he may just fly his Learjet over a forest fire and toss $40 million out the window. This week, Chris Dodd endorsed Barack Obama, and the cashier said, Yeah, yeah, paper or plastic? The Supreme Court plans to hear arguments this year in the 1989 Exxon Valdez oil spill case. And after that, they're going to look into this whole Lusitania business. A man in Tampa, Florida spotted what hundreds now claim is the image of Jesus in a slab of granite, although many believers are dubious as it is not in a grilled cheese sandwich. Heather Mills has settled with Paul McCartney for $104 million and says she wants to use the money to move to Los Angeles. Paul McCartney is thrilled because that's where a celebrity can kill his wife and get away with it. 